Hello guys, thanks for watching this video. I hope you are all doing fun and I hope that you are going to enjoy it. Today's video, I'm gonna be going over my unicorn build. That's why guys, I'm calling this a unicorn build and that is for one simple reason. And that is because of this little guy. You may not recognize it, but this is a Kiss Ultra Mini. Uh, this is pretty much a unicorn when it comes down to your hobby. This is the hardest flag controller you can get your hand on. And your boy got his hand on it. I had to use some connection. You know, I know some guy that knew some guy that knew some guy. So uh, it was not easy to get my hand on it. I got two of them. I got this one and I got the one on the drone already. Uh, this one, I think uh, what I'm going to do, I uh, kind of started working on it. I think I'm going to post a video in the next coming days to where I use one of my uh, drone using a Betafly flight controller of software. And I'm going to fly beta flight, Then I'm going to swap on this guy. I will see if there is any difference because the thing about the kiss ultra is that some people have been arguing this is the best flag controller software on the market for example vanover actually made a video about it and if you know anything about vanover he is a pretty pretty good flyer pretty good pilot he made a video about it and where he pretty much said this is the best flag controller ever so that's what i got and that's why i'm calling it a unicorn because it's hard to get now let's take a deep dive on this build uh, primarily frame. Uh, what I'm using is a Impulse RC Apex 4-inch frame. Uh, if you know anything about the drone and about this hobby, uh, the Apex 5-inch is pretty much seen by many as one of the best frame ever. But if 5-inch costs about 97 bucks, and I already had a bunch of 5-inch, so I didn't want to build another 5-inch. So I went with the little border uh, which is the four inch and i have to say it is a pretty pretty good frame build wise uh, very simple to put together and everything on this build on this frame just scream quality that's what i went for the little four inch i don't have a four inch this is the only four inch i have i got the ultra on it and i have to tell you guys this thing fly great now i can't really say if it is a best flight controller or anything because with my flying skill i can't really make the argument but i would say that as far as i'm concerned uh, this little four inch fly better or as good as any of my other five inch and you gotta remember guys i fly beta flight i fly emu flight and i have uh, fatec drone uh, this thing fly as good as any of them as far as the model goes, uh, what we have are the 21 millimeter model from EPV Saco. Now those are actually rated at 1600 kV. And you think 1600 kV on a four inch, that's is that a little low, but it's actually not. According to EPV Saco website, those models on a four inch prop should be running 6S. And that is actually what I'm running on this drone. And those are the battery I'm using, GNB 720. And those battery flying pretty hard, as hard as I can. I get about five minutes of fly. So not only I'm getting good flyer with the Ultra, I'm also getting a very efficient drone, getting five minutes with the 720. I could go even 660 to save some weight, but 720 to me is a sweet spot. I'm getting five minutes, so that is pretty efficient. Uh, the prop I'm using are gem fan prop and I believe they are 40, 36 props and I got the Ron Cam Tom Pro for the video. I'm not really convinced about this camera. 89 bucks uh, give you 4K video. I think it's 4K 30. Uh, I've been messing with it. I'm going to post the footage of the flights with the Ron Cam at 4K, I'm gonna put another one with the uh, Ron Ken, the Tomp running at 4, 1440. And I'm also gonna post some video of the Vista so you can see the difference between all three different camera. And as far as the ESC goes, I have the Fairtech ESC 25 amp, four in one, uh, pretty good ESC. People hate Fairtech ESC, they say they keep burning on them. I have no issue with them so far and I got like four of them already. Uh, they've been pretty good. A very good drone, fly great. I just want to get you a little hand on what this drone is about, about my unicorn build. In case you want to, you know, copy the same build, I'll say that this is a good flyer. I don't know if it's just the 
frame itself or if it's a combination of the frame and the Quiz Ultra. I say it's mostly the Quiz Ultra, but we found out when I post, when I move this guy on one of my five inch, we see how good is the Quiz Ultra. But uh, this is my unicorn build. Uh, give you a quick look at it. I'm gonna put some footage. I hope that you enjoy it, and I will see you on the next one, guys.